It has all jobs in Italy. General information. If Italy's combination of superb food and wine and la dolce vita, the sweet life, doesn't grab you, then nothing will. Italy proudly boasts fabulous art and opera, a magnificent array of ancient monuments and history stretching back thousands of years. Whether you head for fashionable Milan or ancient Rome in this relatively small country you're never too far away from great beaches, verdant rolling hills or alpine skiing. Who could ask for more? The language primarily in use is Italian, however, it may be useful to note that Italians can understand Spanish. Outside the main tourist areas English is not widely spoken, and indeed the Italian education system is a little deficient on this front. This deficiency in the high school education provision is one of the reasons that there are good opportunities here for English teachers, since many high school students seek to improve on what they have available to them via the state. There is a large number of independent language institutes ranging from elite academies, where experience and qualifications are requisite, to small-scale outfits where a degree, much less a TESOL qualification, may not even be required. Popular destinations. Italy is awash with famous cities, Rome, Florence, Milan, Naples, Venice, and Bologna. Each of these is very distinctive and has its own character and history. It is practically a sin to go to Italy and not spend some time in each of these cities. Breathtaking art and architecture abounds, but it should not be forgotten that the more rural areas, such as Tuscany, have a great charm all of their own. As mentioned, Italy is a relatively small country in European terms, and good public transportation means that it's easy to plan plenty of excursions from wherever you are based. Teaching. If you wish to teach in a state or private high school may need to have a degree, but a TESOL qualification is often enough. Some teaching opportunities in Italy require two years as language teaching experience, but there are always opportunities available for newly qualified TESOL teachers. With language institutes you can, in the main, expect to find yourself teaching children or adults in the same class. Enthusiasm for English amongst the general population can sometimes not be as high, for example, as it is in Germany or Holland, and it is possible that the motivation of those being taught is not quite as great. In the main you will find yourself teaching students a varying ability, even within the same class. Hence, expect all ranges of ability. The challenge, particularly with children, is in motivating them. It is also a task to cope with varying levels of ability within the same class. Nevertheless, Italians can be great fun to teach and can be very enthusiastic. Getting a job. For those seeking work in advance there is no overarching list of the hundreds of language schools, Skuol di Link, which exist in Italy, and one's best resource is the Yellow Pages. International language schools like Berlitz, Benedict schools in Liguorama have a strong presence in Italy, and there are several Italian chains. The Italian groups include the British Schools Group and British Institutes. Another is Oxford Schools. The new arrival would do well to consult the weekly English language papers Rome, Metropolitan and Wanted in Rome. In addition to this placing ads in tobacconists and supermarkets is not a bad idea, and there are also notice boards in the two English bookshops in Rome, Lion Bookshop and Economy Bookshop. Whatever way you look for work it is important to remember that life grinds to a halt in August, as with many European countries. Therefore your travel plans should be formulated to avoid hitting this dead spot during which very little gets done. When contract for a position in an institute it is very important to thoroughly read your contract and check what it stipulates. There can be a slight cultural trait amongst Italians to tell you what you want to hear. The reality may be somewhat different. Remember what is important to you, accommodation, class size, salary, etc. and try and ensure these are adequately catered for in your contract. Visas and regulations. It can be the case that some state schools are not prepared to go through the difficult process of hiring native English-speaking teachers from outside of Europe. 
However, in some cases it is easier to place teachers from the US than from other countries, such as Australia and New Zealand. Non-EU citizens should check with the Italian consulate in their native country to look for language exchange programs, etc. Americans may wish to contact InterExchange, www.interexchange.org, of New York, who run an exchange program. You should be aware of the fact that the reciprocal social security system that exists within the EU means that high schools are required to register their staff for a social security card and also pay part of their contributions. This means that some schools are generally not willing to take on anybody who is ineligible. Most individuals working for institutes are self-employed or freelance. Therefore, they are responsible for paying their own tax and social security. New arrivals are required to register with the police, organize a bank account into which their wages will be paid, and get a tax number from their local tax office. For Americans as well, it is worth trying to see if there are positions available through the US military. The military employs lots of civilians and may be able to process work permits, etc. for you. In addition to this student visas are also an option. Working your way through the bureaucracy you will need original certificates of any qualifications you have, along with passport photos, birth certificate, and passport. Tez all jobs in Italy. Italy is one of the most intriguing places to visit in Europe, so why not spend an entire month there? Come to Rome or Florence and obtain one of the most sought-after TESOL certifications at our ITTT training centers. Indulge in Italian culture, history, and cuisine during your four-week stay while learning to become an English teacher. You could be in a classroom in the morning and in the piazza in the afternoon enjoying some of the finest gelato in the world. Besides food and culture, you can also appreciate some of the finest art architecture and hospitality to be found anywhere on earth. You can join a course at either of our Italy locations every month allowing you to fit the TESOL program into your schedule. Besides the four-week program, our Rome Training Center also offers the combined training course, which includes two weeks of intensive training following an online-based portion of the certification. TESOL Jobs in Italy Upon successful completion of our TESOL course, every graduate can take advantage of our in-depth recruitment assistance. Holding your internationally recognized certification in hand, it should not be difficult to secure a job in Italy. Should you not want to stay in Italy, you can be confident of finding a teaching job in other European countries or elsewhere around the globe. The good news is that English teaching positions are available throughout the year in Italy, and while many new teachers stick to the larger cities, smaller towns are also on the lookout for qualified teachers. Many who start out in Italy continue on teaching English in France, Switzerland, or Greece, where the demand for qualified teachers is also high. During your month in Rome, you are able to completely soak in the city's art, history, architecture, cuisine, and nightlife. The city is full of historic churches, cathedrals and museums where you can spend hours standing in awe of the exquisite artworks. The city's many piazzas also offer delicious street food and shopping opportunities. And don't forget the world-famous Colosseum, Pantheon, and Vatican, all structures within easy reach of our training center in Rome. Tesal course in the Renaissance capital of Italy. If Rome is too busy for you, why not stay in Italy's Renaissance capital? The city of Florence was once the commercial capital of the Roman Empire, and it is still marked by its ancient wealth today. Just like in Rome, the city is filled with breathtaking art and architecture as it is the place where world-famous artists such as Leonardo da Vinci, Dante, and Michelangelo once lived. However, Florence is not only a city of the past, it also shines in modernity with its many galleries, fusion restaurants, and cafes.